Hello, ladies, gents, and poopers, pinching out a log. Let's explore these ruins, and after the exploration is complete, I shall do a little bit of housekeeping. Keeping up with the comments telling me, you missed this, you missed that. Go back and get it. Very important stuff. I am seeing a awesome side of grace with even a cross of Mikola, which probably means, yep, indeed, there is an NPC. It's like... They all gather around it like moths attracted to a trite metaphor. Give me another skibbity tree, fragment. Who might you be? Some sort of monk? That's no. Nothing to say. Nothing to say, absolutely. I abandon here the flesh of my body. Your entire body? Well, whatever is left. What is left? The left bicep? Maybe one. Eyebrow is left? Okay, well, yes, he has vanished. <laughs> uh, is it because there was people? Is that maybe the guy that I was supposed to challenge? Let me grab the rest. Maybe he'll come back? Come back, Mr. Monk. I am ready to challenge you to a duel. The really, I grabbed another skibbity tree. Framing? Give, yes, give me more damage, more damage resistance. I need more power. There's never enough power. So he has nothing to say, right? He has nothing to say. But uh, I remember you. You told me to come uh, duel you or whatever, right? You go to the inventory. Uh, we still should have that note that we grabbed. Really, have I grabbed this many things? I guess I'll have to find in the key items. Illustration of a monk. A letter bearing, blah, blah, blah. Seek me to the east if you wish to pursue the way of the warrior. When you find me, you will challenge me to about. There is no need for words. He indeed is silent. <laughs> you attack! I <laughs> locked onto something else by mistake. Attack! So! The curved shots, okay? I am not responsible for how this wool is curved. Try gesture and then offer arms. Them visions of attacking. Oh, I need to challenge you to about. My bad. My bad. Just come back. No need for words. But I thought that he meant. I thought he meant just throw fists. But thank you, people commenting. What he means is show me a little bit of respect, then attack. I like my fancy spin. I like my erudition. I like my finger snap. Uh, I do like the T pose. I guess we never polite bow. So let's switch this. May the best win. May the best win. Bitch. Punk. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Yeah, I need to be a little bit closer. Come at me, bro. You filthy swine. All right. There is indeed. Uh. Transportation of my body. Let me uh, buff myself a little bit. Are you going to start trying to punch me? Yeah, yeah, you are one martial artist. Wow. What do I have for skills? Oh, I have this one. <laughs> I thought I had the blind spot, but I don't. He's too fast. He's too freaking fast. And he does uh, quite a bit of damage. He's pretty tanky, too. How about you eat some of these arcs? He also enjoys the holy spell. It's too far. I have now assessed your moveset. I now can move into the offensive. <laughs> catch roll. Roll catch. Does the uh, throne discus also bork the AI. <laughs> it seems like they might. I cannot handle your mid-brain jabs. Here, some fire. That works, that works. Huzzah! You cannot escape a bitch. Ah! This holy damage is too powerful. I mean, he, he is quite the fisticuffs enjoyer. 
the closest I have to mimic him is the um, the fist weapons, right? Get this thing, you absolute buffoon. Here, catch one of these. Well, they didn't catch it. You know something else I can do? Is invite him into the Flame of Frenzy. Let me see if we can finish him up. Oh, it would be awesome to finish him up with the, the grab attack from the Flame of Frenzy. But I don't have it uh, memorized. Hey, right, come back. Oh, yeah. Embrace Madness. Uh, not the most honorable duel, right? Because I am chugging like a 3 a.m. drunkard in Ireland. He is fully committed to the honorable duel. Damn! But we, we don't embrace honor. We embrace the flame of frenzy. That's what we embrace. Nobody can stop me when I have chugged seven times in a row. You have been truly bested by the best one. You know who the best one is? The one with the most healing potions. What an idiot trying to fight honorably. Psh, pathetic. All right, give me whatever you were willing. I will upgrade into oblivion. Dry leaf arts. And Dane's hat? Hell yeah, sign me up for this hat. Where is it? I must wear it. Heavy load, huh? It's just that heavy. Fine, give me uh, give me lighter bridges. <laughs> the most fetching hat you could imagine. Truly bringing out the shine on those eyes. Compliments my style a great deal. Amazing. All right, so we got dry leaf arts. Does that mean uh, we've been gathering these dry leaf garments? I oh, know it's grape bird. Never mind. Pretty great, blah, 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 nothing really. Wonder if it's related in any way. It, it looked really uh, funky. Anyway, I have grabbed Dry Leaf Arts. A technique for hand to hand combat without the aid of a weapon. This martial art combines fist strikes and kicks. The teaching of, of a group of spiritual seekers known as the Dry Leaf Sect, revealed only to those of worthy valor and character. They practice, the practice of this martial art marks the dawn of an ascetic journey. I'm ready to be ascetic. I am not wielding it because I'm foolish. Okay, okay, buddy. Probably you have to dual wield it, right? Look at me, punching and kicking. Wow. Check me out. Those combos. Freaking Street Fighter over here. Oh, the strong attacks are where it's at. Incredible monk impact. This is just the way you can become monk. Clearly, we have to check it out. We have to use it. Jump attack. Oh, that's so badass. I'm going to make a YouTube compilation of these incredible martial art kicks sign me up for the gym what is going on here amazing i mean it's okay hey you're holding a jar does that mean no <laughs> it does not have something to do. clearly these punches and upgrade are ass no dog i am not interested in fighting you let me go back bruh, bruh. give me Literally anything else. Die! Filthy. Disgusting dog. Alright. Back into... Let's go upgrade this nonsense. Let's see how, how much damage we can deal with it. Behold! The art of the flaming fist! Actually, there is absolutely nothing, huh? Oh, you can't apply the, the one that actually becomes fire. But I bet that you can... Enchanted with uh, enchanted with the spell electrify armament. Maybe if I make it heavy, give me a moment. Womp, womp, womp. Cannot electrify the martial arts. That's too bad. Let's make it back into the flaming fist. All right, let's check out these runes. What kind of uh, attacks do you do from horseback? The strong attack just slaps someone across the head. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> I was hoping to maybe, like, do a kick or two. Hey. Those on the ground? What's your problem? Your problem is that I punched your spine and crippled you forever. That's your problem. It 
Bruh. Son of a bitch. <laughs> it's actually the entrance to a place. Shattered stone talisman. Talisman. What kind of uh, nonsense is this? Not item crafter, inventory. Kicking and stomping. Just. Just my jam. Lynchpin stones are spiritual anchors that are set to hold the ground in place and quell the fury of earthquakes. When this one is shattered, the ground town, surrounding town fell into a broken earth. One account claimed that the moon itself had come tumbling down. I uh, wonder if... Does that include... Does that include this attack? The, the kick? Or does that simply include, you know, the kicking and the stomping of the ashes of war? Either way, before I climb all the way down there, I'm going to make sure that there's nothing that I missed in this ruin. For example, a piece of loot on top of this rooftop. Wow. How else could I have found a Shadow Realm ruin? Okay, there's not, not just one entrance, it looks like. like oh, yeah, yeah. I don't want to drop right now. I don't want to drop right now. I need to find out what there is to be found out. Ah! <laughs> Son of a bitch! I was like... Ooh, more of those weird ashes. Let's grab it. But these damn horn... Horn heads... Have to be waiting there. Like, do I want to even kill them? Like, what's the point? Just grab the ashes and get out. Like, it's uh, a creature I have fought 20 different times. Hussah! That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage this guy deals. I've been using my skibbity tree religiously. I want to strong attack you. What's up? Holy crap. That's too much. Ah! Being too team. I'm stuck in this scenery. <laughs> ah! Get me out of here. This is stupid. Being mobbed and mogged by wildlife when I'm trying to do an honorable fisticuffs. Somewhat honorable. Here, eat my palm. You didn't eat it, but you know, it's good enough. Do you have anything of interest? No, you're just a piece of trash I shouldn't have fought to begin with. What a surprise. I'm just, I'm torn right now. There's a whole nother area underneath this town. But there's also, holy crap, that is a chasm. <laughs> uh, a whole nother area underneath this town, but I really want to go back and uh, find the places that I haven't done. I'm going to do that just now. And I'm sure it will not take long, okay? Housekeeping will not take long. We'll be back to this area. Don't worry about it. Number one, remember I dropped over there, I ended up in a place I've already been? The actual secret is over here! What's up? Hello, Castle Ensis, we meet yet again. But there is supposed to be an exciting new chest to partake of. Hopefully not surrounded by enemies, it's just, just a nice chest, give me a piece of loot. Cadian Sorcery Sword. Not something that we're going to use, because I am sure it is a intelligence weapon, and I uh, have an IQ of 7. One of the Cadian Royal Family Glintstone Swords, a small and piercing sword with a slender blade, like a magical rapier, I would say. Not my gem, but I'm happy to have this sword. Step number two. From the side of Grace, drop down. A new and exciting path is revealed. Thing is, uh, that is death, but that is not. Seems like we're getting, going back to somewhere we've already been, but, you know, with n awesome new possibilities. Where are we right now? Oh, these are like a, a wall that I have not visited before. You do our, you are, Fog Rift Fort. It's actually completely new. This is, I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. The remember, we went there and we had to go through all this nonsense that people were entrenched 
on the parapet made me angry. Turns out, uh, payback's a bitch, you sons of horse. Cursed! <laughs> well, please don't murder me. Ooh. <laughs> payback was not achieved. <laughs> Instead, I almost kill myself. You're not supposed to explode. Oh, that's right. Uh, my fists are coated in fire. <laughs> That'll do it. That'll do it. My fists are flaming. <laughs> that's when, when I punch the barrel, you create an explosion. Well, they got that lesson anyway. I entered with a bang. Fire arrows. Uh, so just, uh, you know, gently roll into the, <laughs> into the barrels. Do not punch the explosives. That's where I was, right? That's where they the receive you? No, 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 I have not been there. There's another spot that I just haven't been. I will go down there. But obviously, we first need to check out what's up back here. Clearly, I need to just roll into this barrel. Oh! Even now. Ooh, these people are just not, not terribly friendly to not terribly friendly to newcomers. I'm just going to how about I insert madness straight to your brain pan? There you go. Not so tough now, are ya? You? you just punch you straight in the spleen. Alright, alright. Well done. Red flesh mushroom. The, I have stolen the stash. Look, I'm punching this one. <laughs> I had to do it. I had to do it. He was standing on a ledge and he was asking to be exploded. Get me back to the state of Stake America. We are right here. Uh, maybe let's delay a little bit on using the fists of fire on the place surrounded by explosive barrels. All right. <laughs> Just switch real quick. Let's see. Give me maybe something sacred, something lightning. I changed this to to sacred damage. Let's use it again. Uh, am I fat rolling? I am, because the fist weapon obviously is extremely light. So let's just put one of these on. And of course we roll with the rune arc that is quickly depleted. The rune arc stock is quickly depleting. Test. There you go. <laughs> No longer carrying an explosive weapon in my hand. Instead, I carry an explosive weapon in my butt. Ooh, butt attack. Get dust. Get destroyed. Ow. Oh, I'm not interested. Oh, did I go back? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The smithing town. I completely forgot to unequip it, but that's fine because now we are once more with the thrown weapons. So, wake up, dude. I don't think it's worth it though. Like to boost, partially boost the damage of the thrown weapon that you're going to use now and then. Feels pretty wasteful of a talisman, of a talisman uh, slot. Especially with this one, like the the throwing spear probably is worth it. Uh, this one, the range is too short to be boosting it because it only th weapon throwing attacks. Yeah, probably with the spear, is super good. Uh, throwing this one, I don't really throw it that often. Let me just go back to something more standard. Uh, blah, 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 blah. May just get me a better... I know it's more boring, but also extremely more useful. <laughs> Being able to heal more. So You're gonna explode. I don't know why I was warning him. Like, I was concerned for his safety, but there you have it. All right, this fort shall be vanquished with extreme prejudice. Can I get back up here if I drop? Yeah. Swa! I like that, like you throw it, but you also hit on the throw. Please stop. <laughs> Look, I'm entitled to that piece of loot. I'm going to have it whether you want me to or not. You appear to be dead set on ranged combat. So let me give you some of that. So, one of these. Oh, oh, now you're coming over. You didn't like that, did ya? Hoorah! Okay, it's 
scumbag. Get destroyed. Give me the good stuff, baby. Nice, a cookbook. What does this one do? Hefty oil pot. Not something I'm going to ever be using. It seems like just too much busy work, right? I bet that if you min-max, you do a ton more fire damage. But it's like, oh, let me throw this oil pot at you so I can then buff my damage for five minutes. It's like, blech. Not exciting. Clearly, we're going to descend. But first, I shall traverse this bridge. I do have a medical appointment coming up soon-ish. Black Knight Garrett. Oh, what is that? <laughs> he just spit me. No, he he was like a chameleon type of dude. He just tried to attract me with his, his tongue. I feel sexually assaulted. That was atrocious. Traumatizing. What is that, though? <laughs> oh, I am so offended. He, he takes a beating. Holy crap. He just took it, huh? <laughs> You're too powerful. The incredible tongue master, Gary. That's his official name. Gary! Nicely done. Nicely done, idiot! I see. I see you have a holy hammer attack. How about the holy butthole attack? Ooh, spam! Butthole attack! Get butthole, you ass! get destroyed. Actually, you have a ton of health, buddy. Very impressive. Ooh, holy butthole! Attacks again! Block, though. <laughs> He's too powerful. His shield is too powerful. He's just, <laughs> I'm so offended by that existing. This is terrible. This guy, though. Just roll toward him. And he has solved this fella. You roll toward this man, and his entire combat is solved. Am I right? Am I right? Are you going to attack again, or are you going to do anything? Well, okay, if you're not attacking, input reading! <laughs> no, sir. No, sir. You may not. Land. Such a tank. Oh, the, the shield bash. Followed by the giant delay. Oh, no! Oh, I thought I was dead. Woo! Woo! <laughs> all right, all right. Let me, uh... Oh, that was... That was way late, and I still got the dodge out of that. And the bad attack to follow it up, baby. It's so strange. It'll never not wear me out. Follow up. Wow. Hey, get destroyed, Black Knight. You are an incompetent defender of this fort. No wonder you guys are all losers. Ooh, a grid shield. Very happy to get it. Wonder how heavy that is. I bet it's 70 billion pounds. Let's see what you got. 19 pounds? Bruh, it is strength, though. 19 pounds compared to 10 from uh, the... Lord Sworn. Pretty silly. Silly indeed. Alright, this fort. Very happy that I came this way. I think I only have to do the bottom, right? I wonder where it leads. I assume outside somewhere. Bruh. Can I maybe drop behind them? <laughs> I don't want to just... Standing in front of their barrage of fire. That would be kind of stupid. And I did see like a breach in the wall. I saw a breach in the wall right here. How much healing do I have? Like only one. So it, it may be suicidal to go down there. Do it anyway, baby! Oh, you poor buffoons. You poor idiots. Here comes butthole. To ruin your behind. Oh. She did not uh, sneak attack. I am offended. But attack. <laughs> Just annihilation. Absolute destruction. Delivered by my butt cheeks. Straight to your cranium. 
I keep doing a strong attack, thinking that it's going to do a strong attack, but no, that's the throw attack on these things. Okay, if so far this has been a massive waste of time, other than, you know, the satisfaction of coming in here and murdering these fools from the back, none of them sound the alarm. They're all extremely stupid. They really... <laughs> Serpent flail. Check it out, check it out. A flail with coiled snakes, what kind of faith? Faith and uh, dex. A flail with coiled snakes from bludgeoning heads. My favorite kind of thing to do to heads. Fire roars within the snake's bodies, inflicting horrible burns. Some of Mesmer's army use these flails to burn horn scent, to brand them with agony and fear. Very cool. Cannot use it though, why? What, what does it require? Oh, lots of dexterity. Unfortunate. Flails are often pretty boring, but I bet the DLC has some decent freaking flails. Why? Why am I attacking in standard? What I can just butt attack? Pow, 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 pow. Oh, good stuff. Got me some grease. And now we can go all the way back up. Are we done? I think we're done. I deem this fort officially conquered by Lady Butthole. And now, back at the Fort of Reprimand. Because this, right there, is a path I did not follow. See, so we can completely ignore this omen killer and just go down that shaft, see what happens. Surely nothing horrendously dangerous is down here. Shadow Realm Ruin. Oh, it has some kind of underground repository of... Oh! <laughs> okay, <laughs> It's just an oven killer. Calm down. Let's just give him my punches of fury. Super kick. Whoa. I too have fire. Check it out. This is a decent damage. Form of strike. Nice, nice, nice. Iris of occultation. And Marika's rune? What the hell is this? Let me see this iris of occultation. Plays of, on the eye of another to deny them light in all its forms. A consumable. Can also be used to receive the blessing of an equipped great rune at the cost of all runes currently held. Weird. In the Remel Shadow, this artifice was employed by the priests of the Earth Tree to intensify the fears of their flock to magnificent effect. So it's like a... a Rune arc with a downside? Perhaps also some kind of quest item because of the line of place on the eye of another to deny them light in all its forms. And what is this golden remnant of the grace personally bestowed by Queen Marika to the hero heroes who joined the crusade for her? 80,000 runes. Uh, I'm pretty impressed by the damage there of the, of the fire fists. Of course... We grabbed another Skibbity 3 fragment since then. What is going on here? Some kind of uh, confraternization? I don't like that. Mesmer Soldier's Ashes. Alright, it's looking like we may be ready to call this fort fully explored. I am just now realizing I have 522,000 runes in my inventory. Let's get ourselves another level before I throw these runes into the garbage. Oh, this seems to be some battlements I was never... I was never... I never reached. Or maybe I just never noticed that ladder? Nah, it's just the other side of the... The parapets here. I don't know what the proper nomenclature is. I keep using them all interchangeably. And it just goes back to where we fought the knight that is now just dead. All right. Great stuff. Let us go underground. Oh yeah, more ash power that I hopefully will never have to use. And let's get ourselves... What was I doing again? 30 endurance. Get ourselves... Oh, I actually have for two levels. At least. There you go, 185. We'll go into... The plan is to end up at 200. I keep saying it. All right. Let's go underground. I'm very much looking forward to whatever lies beneath this land. I assume it's just a, 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 a town that was swallowed by the earth. Let's go down this way, as opposed to there was another path to follow. Maybe 
they are. In fact, I'm going to leave a reminder there in case that we don't end up in the same place. Thing is, uh, uh, this is just death. <laughs> I don't think. I don't think you're gonna actually go down this way. That drop is just deadly. Well, let me actually go find the other path down. There it is. All right. Jump to the other side. I think this do drop down is fine. Yeah. A dog. Attack! Ow! Feels pretty weird to be punching and kicking dogs. <laughs> this seems like beneath, beneath somebody of my station. To be down in the trenches, punching and kicking dogs. Let me get some lamp on. Ooh, a piece of loot. Incredible. <laughs> I just grabbed the string he hung himself with. Not exciting. All right. That goes further down. Might you have something interesting to say? Lara ahead. Probably somebody had put down a... Oh, secret path ahead! <laughs> I'm so original and funny! Alright, nothing here. It just keeps going down, but what is this way? Several paths to choose from. There's no returning from this one. What is the other one? Oh man, 2.50. It is 2.50pm right now, breaking the immersion. I do need to get ready for going out there into the wilderness, getting my butthole checked out by the doctor. It is not about my butthole, it is <laughs> sleep study because my wife has been whining about uh, I may be getting sleep apnea out or something because I've been snoring way more than usual. I used to not snore at all. Then I became fat and ugly, and now I snore. Okay. Ah, here. Well, all right. <laughs> it's an interesting descent. What are you? I know what you are, but I'm going to be a dirty cheater. I'm going to cheese the crap out of you. Are you okay with this? Or are you going to shoot me the moment that I start? Let's find out. Shoot, madness is straight to your head. All right, well, you're now dead. <laughs> it's just cultists. I thought it was, you know, important people. But turns out, I could have simply equipped this and uh, go down. Hussah! Super kick into oblivion. Why is it open, though? Why is it open? Golden arts. Ooh, a new miracle, about time. We haven't found a single new miracle. Releases a procession incantation, my bad. Uh, releases a procession of golden arcs with a swing of the arm. Sorcery of the Inquisitors of the Tower wielded as an incantation of the Sparrow. A swing of the arm releases a procession of golden arcs. Charging enhances pon potency. The arcs resemble barbs, a known symbol of coercive questioning. Just my kind of questioning. Excellent. So anyway... I need to uh, cut it right here, even though I really don't want to because I'm ever so curious about how deep does this go? Where are we going? Shadow Sunflower. He was holding on to that flower until he dropped dead. We've got a ladder over here. Seems like uh, the opening of a well. Probably a path that I simply did not find all the way back to the surface. Thing is, like, this is one of those gigantic ladders, isn't it? One of those really silly, long, long ladders that are basically... Not this one. This ladder is fine. It's, you know, it, it makes sense in context. But the ladder that leads to Elphiel, it is the stupidest ladder in all game design. On par with the one in... Dark Souls 1 that leads to the Hydra. What the hell, brother? Bunny Village. Well, I am happy to have found this. We're going to go back to the underground to continue exploring. But this will be next, I suppose. There's so many places to find. I love it. I'm loving the DLC so far. Uh, 
I don't know what the detractors are are saying. They're just whining for attention. The people on the internet are saying that this expansion is bad. Whiners for clicks is what they are. 